Hey guys, Aubrey here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 4 Module 1 Lesson 18 homework. So let's get started. Draw a tape diagram to represent each problem. Use numbers to solve and write your answer as a statement. Alright, so number one, there were 22,869 children, 49,563 men, and 200, I'm sorry, and 2,872 more women than men at the fair. How many people were at the fair? Alright, so let's start with our tape diagram. So let's start with what we know. We know that children, we can label C for children. There were 22,869 children. And then we also know M for men, that there's 49,563 men. What we don't know is how many women there are. But it says there's 2,872 more women than men, which means that W for women has at least 49,563, but then it has um, 2,872 more people. So we're trying to find out the total amount, so how many people were at the fair all together. All right, so how can we find that out? First, let's find how many women there are. So we know there's 49,000, 563 men, so then add 2,872 more women. So three plus two is five, six plus seven is 13, five plus eight is 13, plus one is 14. Um, nine plus two is 11, plus one is 12, and four plus one is five. So there's 52,435 women. So if we're trying to figure out how many people are at the fair altogether, Let's add 22,869 children plus 49,563 men and 2,000, two wait, did I, no. And then for women, there's 52,435. So let's see. 9 plus 3 is 12, plus 5 is 17. 6 plus 6 is 12, plus 3 is um, 15, plus 1 is 16. 8 plus 5 is 13, plus 4 is 17, plus 1 is 18. 2 plus 9 is 11, plus 2 is 13, and then plus 1 would be 14. And 2 plus 4 is 6, plus 5 is 11, plus 1 is 12. So our answer is 124,867. So there, there were 124,867 people at the fair. All right, so now number two. Number A is 4,000. 676. Number B is 10,043 greater than A. Number C is 2,610 less than B. What is the total value of numbers A, B, and C? So that we know A, number A, is 4,676. And then B is at least that amount because it is then like 10,043 greater. And then C is like here. So C is, oh, wait. C, actually, C is actually like right over here. C is 2,610 less than B. So this much plus. And we have to find out what is the total num um, value of, the, of all three numbers. All right, so what we can do first is find, well, let's find what B is. Because we can't find C without finding B first. So first, let's do 4,676 plus 
6 plus 3 is 9, 7 plus 4 is 11, seven, 6 plus 1 is 7, 4 plus 0 is 4, and the 1 just stays a 1. So B would be 4, I can do like, B is 14,719. So now we have to find C. So we do 14,719 minus 2,610. 9 minus 0 is 9, 1 minus 1 is 0, 7 minus 6 is 1, 4 minus 2 is 2, and 1 stays 1. So then C is 12,109. So let's find the total amount. So A, 4,676, and then B is 14,719, and then C is 12,109. Let's add all together. 6 plus 9 is 15, plus 9 is 24. 7 plus 1 is 8, plus 0 is 8, plus 2 is 10. 6 plus 7 is 13, plus 1 is 14, plus 1 is 15. Alright, 4 plus 4 is 8, plus 2 is 10, plus 1 is 11. And then 1 plus 1 plus 1 is 3. So our answer is 31,504. So the total value is 31,504. All right, and then for our next page, this one. So number three, a store sold a total of 21 1,650 balls. It sold 11,795 baseballs. It sold 4,150 fewer basketballs than baseball. Um, the rest of the balls sold were footballs. How many footballs did the store sell? All right, so let's see. So baseballs, we could do B for baseballs or like PA. We know they sold 11,795 baseballs. And it says basketballs, they sold 4,150 fewer than baseballs. So basketball, we can write, oh, I guess we can just write basket, basketball, I guess. So they sold basketballs then is around this much. And they sold 4,150 fewer basketballs and then the rest were just uh, for footballs so how many total footballs oh, wait, actually. but yeah we know they sold a total of 11,795 so we're trying to figure out how many footballs so let's first start by finding out how many basketballs there are so 11,795 minus 4,150 5 minus 0 is 5, 9 minus 5 is 4, 7 minus 1 is 6, 1 minus 4, borrow 10, 11 minus 4 is 7, and here's a 0, so we don't write anything. So our answer is 7,645. Alright, so that means that that's how many base basketballs there are. So then now to find out footballs, we know the rest of fo our, football, our footballs. But since we know how many baseballs they sold and how many basketballs they sold, we can add that up and then subtract that from the total to find how many were, was like left. So how many are footballs? So let's see, 11,795 plus 7,645. Five plus five is 10. 9 plus 4 is 13, plus 1 is 14. 7 plus 6 is 13, plus 1 is 14. 1 plus 7 is 8, plus 1 is 9. And 1, just leave as 1. So, we got 19,000... Oh, oh, wait, did I write 20? I wrote 21,000. Oh, wait. Yeah, wait, hold up. I wrote, like, the total wrong. <laughs> The total was 21,650. 
So our answer, we got 19,440. So that's how much baseballs and basketballs are combined. So then to find the amount of footballs, we just subtract this from the total. So 21,650 minus 19,440. Zero minus zero is zero. Five minus four is one. Six minus four is two. One minus nine borrowed 10. 11 minus 9 is 2, and 1 minus 1 is 0. So 2,210, which means footballs, they sold 2,210 footballs. So I can write the store sold 2,210 footballs. So yeah. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps on my channel. See you next time. Bye!